Well, summer camps are gearing up for a more normal season. We're taking a closer look at their precautions, especially with the new approval of the COVID-19 vaccine for younger children. Our Jackie Pascal takes us to King to see what you can expect. Yeah, here at YMCA campaigns, they are starting to get some school groups visiting just for the day, but it's giving camp leaders a small taste of normalcy, that glimmer of hope going into the summer. Grass has a fresh trim, the sun is shining, water glistening. Campaigns is ready to welcome back hundreds of kids this summer. Even though there's things that are different, it's still camp and it's still coming home. So many couldn't come to their second home last year due to the pandemic and statewide restrictions, limiting the camp's capacity to just 50% and cutting down its programs. But this summer, they're going up to 75% with four new cabins and hundreds of acres of land to space out safely. The biggest focus is going to be um, being outdoors as much as possible with activities. And then we're going to uh, focus on um, everything will be in small cohort groups. These measures are similar to last summer, including extra hand washing and a drive through health check in when those kids arrive. But one recent change is vaccine approval. The CDC and FDA saying kids ages 12 through 15 can now get Pfizer's two dose shots. But the camp says that announcement is not changing much of their rules. We serve kids six to 16 years old. And so we'll have kids on camp that are not eligible and kids who are and kids in process. So we're not gonna move forward with anything different in our procedures. We're planning on people not, so that way we're ready no matter what, but we are highly encouraging it just to keep the community safe and overall. The executive director says she feels confident with their safety protocols and that a fun summer is ahead. The social, emotional, physical, mental health of kids right now, we're hearing so much of how much we all need support in those areas. Camp naturally is an environment for that. Now, the executive director did say their day camps are full, but there are seven weeks of overnight camps. There are still some openings for that. We have more information on how to sign up for that on our website, WXAI12.com. In King, Jackie Pascal, WXAI 12 News.